Hi, uh, my name's Rebecca. I'm co-founder of Teddington Trust. Someone asked me the other day, how did I get involved in starting this charity? So I thought I'd do a little video blog and just introduce how it all came about. So on the 14th of February 2012, my sister phoned with the news that her son, my nephew, had been diagnosed with xeroderma pigmentosum. And like everyone, when you don't know what something is, you get online and you Google it. And there I sat for, I actually don't know how long, I've actually got no idea how my children were fed that night, or even how they got to bed, but I sat there and read everything that I could find. I drank in every image and every article and there I sat pretty much just sobbing until my husband said enough is enough and dragged me away. And so we spent late into the night discussing what, what was going to happen, what was his life going to be like. Having children ourselves we could, we could instantly imagine uh, how would he go to nursery, how would he go to school, how would my sister go back to work, all of the things that we could instantly see as difficulties ahead for them. And we just felt so helpless and it felt so hopeless. And so we said, right, you know, we're practical, we can do something about this. We're 600 miles away, but we can't, we can't help her with childcare, but we can, we can support them. So we thought, right, we will set up Teddington Trust and if nothing else, we will concentrate on the helping her to look after him so that they didn't have to worry about that side of it. So really, that was how it was born. And, um, and it, was, it was an amazing time and, uh, and uh, the support that we received was absolutely overwhelming and it, it couldn't have been a better experience from that point of view. And as the years have gone on and, the, and our projects have expanded and the charity has expanded, it has been, it's been such a wonderful thing to be part of. It has given me skills I never thought I would have. It has enriched my life in a way that I didn't actually think was, was possible. It has been an absolute honour to meet the people that we have met, to work with the people that we've worked with. Um, and to have helped the families that we have been able to help, even in some small way. So it has been very much a roller coaster. Every day I feel like a fraud in my own life because I seem to be doing things that I've never done before and got absolutely no knowledge in. But it works and it pays off and it's, it's, um, it's a great thing, a great thing to be involved in. So that's really how it started and why I'm involved. So thank you very much for listening. Bye.